I decided to do a little video today and the reason for it is people are talking about how they need to make money and so I started thinking about that and one way that people have been able to make some extra income and some of them very substantial income is through posting videos on YouTube now I can't think of anybody that comes right off the mind that makes a lot of money but there are youtubers out there that the majority of their income comes from producing content for YouTube so just as an example I'm doing this video on radio reference and so as you can see the website is up right now and I'm going to show you how you go about finding radio frequencies that you would like to listen to in your area and this is an example of how it works I am using software called Bandicam and it is one of the best software packages that I have tested out to do screen recording uh, now it might not be the absolute best but given pricing and features and everything I chose Bandicam as the software to use and it has a little function to where you can show yourself on webcam while you're doing what you do so some people like to do that too you don't have to do that so alright frequency database so we'll click on that oh wow they have really changed this a lot since I was here last alright there's how you browse for frequencies browse all data okay browser's current location which now you'll find out that the location that's reported to websites can be very different from where you really are they use a database of IP addresses and locations to try to correlate where you are which might not be where you really are and this is if you are going to submit radio frequencies for the database so that you can share information that you've gained with others to help them out I've done this as well so we'll just continue this tour and you can even search for a location that you're wanting to monitor very interesting nice layout okay so we'll go up here let's try the near me function see how accurate it can get allow it to see my location county menu page okay so that's where you would go that's interesting ok 
County categories and agencies. So there are benefits if you are a premium member. Okay, so let's just scroll a little bit and see what we have here. Coney County Emergency Services DMR Conventional Network. Okay. Let's see what that is. And as you can see, there's the frequency right there. Site 1 Mountain Rest has a frequency of 154.1675 with a color code of 9. Let's click on Mountain Rest. Nice little map. Back to Systems. Now, as you can see here, it says that they're using slot one. And there's a suggested tag for it. go back to near me and we'll go back to Oconee County and there are the other frequencies you have EMS in the Sheriff's Department Now, the thing to note here is that some of this information is provided by volunteers that listen in and find frequencies and information and share it with you. So, being that it's volunteer, it's not kept up by officials that are going to come here and change the frequency as it changes to make sure you're up to date. So some of this information might not be completely accurate at this given time. So you'll want to go in and check those frequencies and information to see what information you are actually listening to.
let's see, uh, and let's go to the amateur radio. And here are the listings for the amateur radio frequencies in our area as well. In case you wanted to listen to those, you can actually see the call signs by area too. That's very interesting. So, I hope you like this video. I had not seen this until I came here and started recording this video. So I was completely unaware about the exciting new changes at RadioReference.com. It's a really nice interface and, you know, some people might like the older interface better, but I kind of like it. It's polished. So this video explains about videos and you know you can look on Google and there's actually a website called Site or is it Social Blade? It might be Social Blade but anyway you can go and look and see what different YouTubers and I think they cover Twitter as well and they show the followers now on YouTube you can get an estimated view of their income so you can just see how many users they have that are subscribed to their channel how many views and how much they're potentially making in a term so that's just one way that you can make extra money to help out and every little bit helps so I hope you found this video interesting and don't forget to subscribe and thank you for visiting my group of Coney County Road Conditions and Wrecks and Local News. Take care.